My name is Craig Aaron. I'm the president of Free Press, the national nonpartisan nonprofit advocate for media policies in the public interest. And I'm here today on behalf of our more than 75,000 members in California. As this body considers how to best address AT&T's takeover of T-Mobile, I urge you to look closely at the harms this merger would cause to California consumers due to a lack of competition in the wireless market. Consider that in a post-merger landscape, AT&T and Verizon would control nearly 80% of the market for mobile telecommunications. As a result of this merger, the wireless market would be more consolidated than the markets for oil, banking, automobiles, and air travel. Just try to picture ExxonMobil merging with BP, Shell, Chevron Texaco, and Citgo. And to make the comparison still more accurate, imagine that after the merger you have to sign a contract saying that you can buy Exxon Gas and only Exxon Gas for the next two years. It seems outrageous, but we should be even more outraged about this level of concentration in the wireless market for a service that Americans increasingly depend on to communicate. And we should keep in mind that the communities that can least afford it will bear the cost of lining AT&T's coffers. Half of T-Mobile's customers are people of color, many of them benefiting from lower cost offerings that will disappear when T-Mobile does. Also vanishing will be billions of dollars in job creating capital expenditures, at least $10 billion worth according to AT&T's own reports to Wall Street, and thousands and thousands of jobs will be lost because of new synergies. In 1984, when the Justice Department broke up the old Ma Bell, the prevailing consensus was that AT&T had gotten too big. But the AT&T T-Mobile merger would create a new behemoth that's substantially bigger than that old conglomerate. As Congressman John Conyers has said, instead of Ma Bell, we would be left with Ma Cell. <laughs> the results of this merger will certainly be higher prices, fewer choices, and an inevitable loss of jobs as well as serious threats to free expression and the free market on the wireless internet. I urge you to closely scrutinize this merger. Thank you. Thank you.